Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. We are in the land of Neo 2, continuing where we left off in the Tengu's Disciple. So last time, uh, we kind of just did a medley of side missions. Uh, and obviously, like, we had an issue with recording where I actually completed some of the Mystic Arc um, dojo stuff. So that's basically all we did. Like, I feel like there wasn't well, there wasn't much. Nothing really notable happened. I mean, we're trying out some new some new tech. Like using feathers and burst countering, or using arrows to sheath and into a into a lie counter. Besides that, I don't think we did anything too spectacular. I mean, I fucking slapped the new. That was pretty fucking spectacular. But besides that, we didn't do much. So I think what we're ready to do is we're actually ready to just move to the next zone, head east. Um, and although it doesn't matter, I will point this out because I didn't realize I had done it. Um, someone had mentioned that I should make sure to put a blessing on. I did have the samurai blessing on. I've since changed it to the oracle blessing, at least for this zone. I'll try to remember not to, like, to get the correct ones for the next area. Um, but I, at some point I did put equipment drop rate on. I don't remember when. Might have been in the, the lost section of the, the recording. But, we're ready to just go. There's not much else to say besides let's fucking head east. We've got places to be. It's always funny when they use like the goddamn Tetris shapes for their army. Ooh, this guy's gonna be a beast. This guy just gives off, like, I'm a rogue samurai vibes. He doesn't give off, like, general or, or lord or army commander. I don't know why. Maybe it's because we heard him talk, the way he speaks. Fujiwara clan. Our enemies. Bro, that's like the I feel like that's the first time we've seen us. You know this game's fucking wild when you have a a red-headed bowl cut man with a demon mask talking to a floating goat. You know, the game just doesn't get more serious than that. What do we got cooking over here? Uh we haven't picked up any Kodama, so I'm assuming there won't be an option to. Oh. So I guess maybe the whole DLC um, gives us this. I thought this would change. I guess it makes sense because we are, um, like if we view the country map, Tengu's Disciple is its own, like, it's a region of its own. So I guess that would make sense. We just went, I'm assuming west. Yeah, so we came from the west to the east. So what's popping off here? Seito Tashio Soul Core, the Eternal Rivals. This is interesting too. Our recommended level, like what level are we? Like, we're up there for sure. We're one fifty one. Hmm. Yeah, because these missions have, they're they're lower level. And I, I I wonder if we're over leveled for the DLC. I say this before I get fucking whapped. But I guess we'll see. Perhaps Haku Taku has informed you already, but we must face a most urgent situation. While being pursued by the forces of Fujiwara, Yoshitsune to have vanished further, seems to have vanished. Furthermore, it seems that Chusan Temple, the place where he was heading, is completely surrounded by the Fujiwara. Hmm. As things stand, we won't be able to enter from the front, but if the rumors are to believe there is another way to get into the temple. Now we really want to get going. There is not a moment to lose. Let's fucking go. I love that we're advised by a goat and a cat. I don't know why that just, it feels fitting. I feel like maybe on a more personal note, it feels fitting because I fucking eat and I fucking sleep. These are two things that, that I fucking do. Okay. Obviously the joke being that goats fucking... <laughs> 
成績の光に目がくらんだか醜き人の強要<笑>先に行け弁慶<笑>衣構え私もすぐ後を追う Benkai is such a fucking beast, dude. You know, I wonder. This is. It feels really odd that the spirit stones are corrupting people right now. When I thought、uh, Otekamaru, or Kashin Koji, or whatever the actual name is,、uh, I thought he was the one behind using the spirit stones to manipulate. And obviously, this all took place in the future, so this could be the case. That I wonder if he is a persistent force through the DLCs in terms of being a villain or an enemy. It feels like it, it's possible.、Um, and we're, we're going to see the influence through time, right? All the way through、uh, Darkness in the Capital and then the first samurai. I don't know. May the, perhaps one of the DLCs will actually be the original time he was sealed away. I don't, uh, yeah, it could be. I could see it.、Um, something that I think I should do go in here. I want to attune. Where the fuck is it? The, yes, the new core. Let's attune this to my other. How do I do it? Is it not possible? I'm not certain. I guess I'd have to go in here and fucking equip the second spirit first. What can I do it from here? Okay, we can do it from here. Exchange soul cores. Where is the new. So, what does this do for me? Anima gauge charge, anima critical, lightning damage. Shock accumulation on an enemy. Hmm. This has me thinking. What if we put on for our secondary core? I guess we're gonna lose the passive bonus, like, it might be kind of not good. Life drain on a strong attack. I guess that's fine. We, we do a lot of strong attacks anyway. Generating passive life isn't that big of a deal. So, this is going to be our secondary spirit. And what we're going to do, because of the lightning damage specifically, we're going to put on a new. I guess you can stack these. So, we could even put on. Where is it? Level 134. We could even put on this. Just because Kasha is insane. We do get an anima bonus on electrification. This just. He just gives us anima. But. We could do something else. This gives us anima. Anima charge unscathed. See what these have. Damage taken. Anima charge and yokai shift. Attack. Anima bonus on a poison.、Eh. Equipment drop rate. That's not bad. As a passive, that's not bad at all. But honestly, I guess we just put on the umbrella. Now, obviously, this is a brute core, and we don't have any brute. Things to slot in. Unless we wanted to put in this. What are we at? 236. I guess that is a pretty big dip, like, bump. Fuck, maybe we should just do this. Okay, which one of these have anima? Anima. Uh, actually, we will put on the equipment drop rate. And then maybe we can get some good shit. Ah,、oh, 1% is not that big of a deal unless you're farming. I lied. We will go with Anima. Okay. That is our secondary core. And it has the new 
four on it. Also, I forgot to do this. We are going to swap out our fire buff for an electricity buff. What did we unlock in here that's new? Okay, can I attune more of these? I can. I can attune one more. Okay, dude, we should add another uh, another hot bar while we're in here. Where the fuck is this setting? That's the real question. It in this. I'm looking for numbers. So if I'm scanning this and not seeing it, then I'm fully botting out. Um, menu settings. Three. Ooh, that's cool. I mean, we're not going to fuck with this now, but we could have changed this to be something sick. I guess orange is pretty sick. We haven't even seen orange yet. Okay, so now we ready the jutsu. We have our third item shortcut. Now, do I want to... I sh should probably move these around a little. Um, let's unready everything. I guess we don't have to for these. We can just kind of double up. Okay, so... Oops. Let's put our kind of our main objects... You know, the Pleiades and the Extraction and the Guardian Spirit. These will all go in the main bar. Which feels feels good. Then we're going to come up here. We're going to take off of our Fire Enchantments. Or our, our Talismans. Slap on the Lightning ones. In bar 2. Mm, sure. That's fine. Now, what's going to go with it? I want to put... We probably want to put quick change on the bottom. The things that we don't use. Well, like we don't use often, that is. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on a moment. Put this on the side. We're fucking putting the goddamn elixirs on top. Because we're not we're not having that happen again. So we want, definitely want to have multiple feathers, I think. So six fire feathers. And these can go on bar two. As well as the lightning feathers. Only two of them, but that's fine. These will also go on bar two. That seems fine. I'm not going to equip just like one shuriken or some shit because... That's just fucking dumb. It's gonna do 30 damage and never be used. Um, I don't think there's anything else that we can actually put on in here either. Everything has a greater cost than one. Okay, so... This is taking a little bit longer than expected to, to kind of go through and, and mess with some of this stuff. Um, yeah, so this... We're gonna set this to here... And while we're in here, we're going to put some other shit on there. Like antidotes. Put this on the right. And I think what we'll do is we'll throw a sacred water on the bottom. Just stuff that we use sometimes. Just so we have it. Could use salt. Ah, fuck it. We've got enough. Okay. We will come back to that when we have more things to, to equip. Okay. Forward and onward. What do we got going on here? The whole fucking gang here to party? Oh. Oh, that was a mistake. Oh. Oh, dude, we fucking hit that guy with the grapple. I didn't even know you could do that. Dude, you can cleave enemies in the grapple. That's fucking nuts. I can't believe this guy didn't come for us. Oh, he fucking nodded. We missed. 
Okay, we're gonna... I'm gonna try to explore as much as possible since we're doing a main mission. Um... If I miss stuff, apologies in advance. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, shit. What's up, brothers? Yeah, you thought. Huh? You thought you want to get fucking paralyzed, brother? Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Dominated. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, he's still alive. Woo. Okay. Well, that was almost horrific. Thought we were dead. Or, I thought he was dead. Okay. Let's head up the fucking castle. Oh, we can... Wait, can we go around here? No. Okay. We'll also... I'll try to... Uh, I've been thinking about it. You know, mid stance is actually not that bad with the sword. The problem is all of our fucking sick combos are high stance. But, which, you know, I like high stance in general. That's been kind of evident from the start. But specifically with the sword, just like how, you see, when you use the spear, I feel like the spear can be used low for, for various things, medium for like distance poking, uh, top for stunning into like attacking while pulsing, right? While key pulsing. I mean, low stance, to be honest, is kind of just dodging and flying monkey. But with the sword, I don't get that same vibe. It very much feels like a heavy or a high stance weapon. Like, so like, for example, the fists. Fists are fucking high stance as fuck. And I feel like not all weapons are like that, but there definitely are some. See ya. Ooh. A little cave action. Open this up, first of all. Open says me. Holy shit, that door was begging to be opened. Shit flew right open. Okay, nothing over there. Alright. I hear fighting. This is interesting. Looks like little Aramada, um, or Aratama, like horns, that you'd see on some of these enemies. What's going on, These people are just, I just hear fighting underneath us. Nobody else is bothered by it. Oh, there's another guy. Sorry, bud. Oh, they're mining. Oh, that makes sense. So this castle... Dude, what's with all these fucking castles being built on top of spirit stone mines? Who saw me? This guy? What's up, brother? What's up, brother? Okay. I always forget we have that attack. That attack's fucking nuts. Woo! Never want to get grabbed. It's the worst thing to happen in this game. Because you get fucking grabbed. And a, a flawless fight becomes a struggle for your life. God damn, those uh, those stuns off the arrows, mwah. Feels good. Really uh, putting the ninja thing into action, the ninja part of our kit, which is the bow. Oh. Jesus, bro. I thought we were going to get screwed by uh, by cameras. Wait. 
Hit him in the head. Oh. oh. That'll do. Let's go. We're getting a little bit of frame droppage in here. I guess it's just, just a really big environment. Like, fuck, I don't, give, I don't even care what that is. Nothing, that's the answer. I do care about my little friend here, though. Do you have to fall down from up top? Well, I guess so. Okay, well, let's try not to forget about him. Actually, does this, does that water buff affect grapplers? I don't know. I couldn't tell. Maybe. Oh. Yeah, I'm actually not sure if it does. It might. I don't know if it matters. I guess it does. If it's, I think it's 20%. It's actually quite significant, especially when you're doing critical attacks. It won't, can't get through there. Oh my god, dominated. See you, bud. Dude, when the burst counter hits, mm, it just feels good. Dude, I love that we're just collecting uh, Amrita here because it's just flooding our, our anima. Can we get through this one? Is there a little pool in there? The bath time? Oh, what the fuck is that, dude? Okay, well, I don't want to fight this guy uh, two on one if I can avoid it. Okay. Let's see what this fucking. Oh, dude, he's like a walking nutsack. Yo, look at him jiggle. <laughs> he's got that Kim Kardashian blood in him. Holy shit. Alright. Let's see what this guy has to offer. Shoot him in the boob. The boob eye. The booby. He looks like he should be weak to fire. Can't tell what he's doing. Oh! Not, fire is not the uh, the weakness of that guy. Okay. Two on one fights? With that thing is gonna be fucking annoying, man. When he does the, uh, the goddamn suction cup. That is gonna be brutal. Alright, I hope we didn't miss stuff up top. Like, I hope we do get a chance to go get that uh, Kodama, for example. Let's see about Rum, 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 rum. Eat them all up. I guess we're full. Still XP, I guess. That blue thing on my map. Oh, that's through that door. How the fuck do we get back there? Wait, let me try it again and make sure I didn't just, like, fuck it up the first time. Oh, blocked. Okay. Can't go in from that way. Can we break these? No. Oh, wait. I didn't even see this guy before. Oh, I guess he's probably hiding because we were fighting here. Come, friend. Alright, so where's that shrine? Up there. Okay. Oh, that's not good. Oh, 
Oh, we're fine. Okay. Well, that'll do. I like how this guy jumped down on top of us before we even, like, got our buff off. He saw us with the hardest friend, and he's like, no. Don't even think about it. Is this a ladder? It is not. Oh, dude, I... Fuck, for the love of God, please give us the core on that guy. We need one. And I just haven't been wanting to go and farm it. Okay. How in the fuck? You have to just fall down there, I guess, and land and just hope you don't slide off. Is there anything else to explore here first? Before we tackle the ways that we have available? I don't think so. Or what's up here? Well, maybe we'll get something crazy out of this guy. Um, here, do you want a long spear, my friend? It's level 150 plus one. I guess maybe I should have kept that to level up my other weapons, but maybe he'll give us one. Ninja Master Fists. Honestly, that's fine. It's only 150, but we've used the Ninja Master Fist before and they were pretty good. Strong attack damage, strong attack key consumption. Uh, melee key consumption on criticals. Yeah, that's fun. Honestly, that's a decent trade. Maybe net loss, but we're not going to really notice it. Oh, we have a level. Yeah, so we want to level up our magic and our dexterity to 30. And we're going to do dex, even though, like, obviously this is close. I don't think we really have much magic to add right now. Like, we're probably going to add some shots, maybe some purity shots or something. But we're definitely going to be leveling up our, not our feathers, but, like, those big blasts on the far left side of the ninjutsu tree. So we need to have more slots available. All right. Dude, look at that bitch. Okay. First things first. Let's see if we can fall down on this thing without getting fucking owned. I always hate doing this. Alright. Come with me, my friend. Now we have to run. Oh, we should have definitely opened that door first. Wait. Do we have an item just returned to the fucking... I know, I know it exists somewhere. Signpost amulet, maybe? Uh, visitor amulet. Nope, signpost amulet. fuck does this do that's not that clear place a signpost to your current location which is also just what oh it's literally just okay well never mind travel amulet yes instead of having to fight all of the same enemies again just to get the kodama this is what we will do okay so what are our options here on where we can go so there's this. Is this even open? No, I didn't think so. Okay, so we get to go down. Hopefully, we get the Epen Core. That would genuinely be a huge upgrade for us. Oh, fuck. 
Actually, that killed him way faster than I thought it would. Go core. Unlucky. But, I feel like we could farm him. Here's what we're... Okay. I'm, I'm only going to do this once right now. I'm going to sit at the shrine and see if he specifically respawns. But I'm... He also doesn't have the hammer. I don't want the sword one. He did respawn. Okay. A little Eepin' on Eepin' action, baby. Okay. Didn't drop anything. That's fine. I, uh, I don't plan on just sitting here and farming him right now. I'm here to play through the game and experience the story first. And what the game has to offer and the bosses. Okay, so got two motherfuckers in here chilling. You know what I'm gonna do? Pop a fucking one of these. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh. Not bad. Soul core. Heal up. Oh, he dodged it. What a legend. Ooh. Master Archer's hat with the upgrade symbol. What do we have on right now? Oh. Uh. We'll wait because I know we had the uh, we had the talks last time about putting on specific armor. Wait, what? Or taking off other armors? Because we only need the three piece on our current set. But we can do some moving around. What the fuck is going on here? Oh, hello. Wait, did I just completely miss that? You don't even have to go over here? Oh, shit. What we got going on here? I love that those guys can be fucked up by fire. It's so good for us. If those enemies were like fire resistant, they would be way harder to deal with. Okay, we got two delicious looking chests down there. Motherfucker. Give me, give me, give me. Well, let's open this up first of all. So it's easier to get back here if we die. We're not going to die, but just in case. Okay. there but I'm all for it oh 
don't know what that buff is. I have to look at the uh, the outlining. Jesus. Nope. Nope. Finish him off. All right. And we got some stuff. I love stuff. Okay, let's grab these chests before we look at anything. I'm not gonna lie, I used so much of our stuff. I was like, let me just use things. Just to see what happens. Just kind of what happened there. Is this just gonna be spirit stones? No, we got an axe. Some pants. Okay, so. Can't use these, so I don't care. Well, I can't get the bonus, I mean. Okay, so this. Is probably worth. Using. To be honest. We are on a three-piece, so we could put on the helmet. What about this stuff? Anima charge on a critical. We already get anima charge from both of these by default. Let me read about this thing. A yokai material taken from a nupepo, nu nupipu. According to the legend, the flesh of nupipu can be used to brew an elixir that grants one great power. Livers are also believed to contain all of the vitality and spiritual power of their owner, making them a prized ingredient in the brewing of various medicines. Nipupu's liver is thus a particularly powerful medical ingredient, but can just as easily be turned into poison if not handled with the appropriate know-how. I know that's not how you say it, but that's how I say it. What does this thing do? Okay, so it's just a big smack. Ooh... That's pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. That's actually a bigger upgrade than swapping out the other things. Oh, it's too heavy for us. Fuck. This isn't actually, which is good. Okay, we need to go to our armor then. So, I know we have... Here we go. So... We're gonna lose some anima charge. But we're gonna gain a bunch of defense. And I think it's worth it. So... I think it's... Where are they? Are there pants? Are they all at the bottom now? Oh my god, I just... I don't know if this is me, but I just realized this is sorted head to toe. Everything at the top is head, then it's uh, body, then it's arms, pants should be next, pants, and then boots. God damn. The more you know. Okay, so we can put on... I guess we have a couple of options here for better boots. Well, we can't use those ones, so we have two options. These feel better. Running speed, life, fire resistance, and defense, dodge key consumption. Let's take this. So we still have our th three piece. Let me confirm that. Oops. Kuroko, Kuroko, as I. Yeah, so we still have a three piece. And we'll rock that for now. Alright, we don't need the rest of the fucking bonfire. We're just good to go. We are stacked and racked. Wait, how do we get into that fucking other room? Down there. Is 
It's. I mean, I know it's just a pond, and we've already missed some, so it's not like we're we need to get this one for an achievement. But I don't know where I had the option to like go through a wall or something. Maybe there was a hidden wall, but I assumed you'd fall down because it feels like it makes sense. Um, I'm not going to just run around and kill everything again and look for a door because that is not an impactful thing to have. But it is good to note. We, we may still swing back and get it at some point. Depends. I don't know the level setup. Feels like we're going in the opposite direction, so maybe not. What the fuck's going on in here? I hear someone jumping around. Hello, friend. We are out of the cave, so perhaps... Unless... You... Motherfucker. Let's just fucking slice them since lightning does damage. Yeah, holy shit. You don't even bounce. When your sword has lightning, you don't even bounce against them. That's actually kind of crazy. Yeah, we can't go that way. Oh my god. The need to sneeze. Are we good? I think we're good. Let's do this again. Oh my god. These things are a joke. When you've got lightning. Big ups to everyone who mentioned that. There's a couple of people. That's huge. Those enemies are fucking annoying to fight. Okay. Uh, we can't level anything up. I'm not using the soul cores we found. So now what's happening in here? Sorry, friend. Well, this guy's fucking girthy. Oh, he slothed us. Fuck. What does he have on his weapon? Corruption? Or, oh my god, it's a paralytic, I think. Do that again. Get him in the corner! Break his shit! God, this guy's fucking annoying. Okay. At least we got his weapon. I mean, we don't really use him, but that was also sick. Our guy just fucking 
through. Oh my god, Benkai's armor. Wait a minute. I wonder if they killed Benkai. I guess probably not. I just think maybe. Maybe they did. Okay. Well, cool enough. We're gonna go sit. Oh, I didn't even look at the goddamn pop. Woo! Let us have your stuff. Me? What do we get? Again, I don't think anything too... Nothing too crazy. Okay, let's go rest at the shrine real quick. Recoup some of this stuff. We're not fighting that guy again. I hope he doesn't respawn. He doesn't, okay. Dang, that'd be awful, because we didn't even make it like into the doorway, and he was like, you, is it? And he just like came for us. There's nothing back here. Nope. Fuck the crab. Can I just rest and you'll go away? Nice. Okay. What's cooking? Good looking. So. Oh, this is closed. Okay, so we gotta go around. Perfect. I don't have to worry about deciding anything. See ya. Yeah, we did 3,700 damage. Uh, the last time. Ooh. Okay. The antidote. So the water, it did a bit, like, when he was under the water debuff, the grapple did, like, seven, eight hundred more damage. I don't remember the... Seven hundred and change. Jesus. I want to parry this guy. Unless I just... Unless I'm going to just die trying to do this. Okay. We're not... Uh, we're not going to play that game. The game of getting fucking smacked around while we try to practice it. Are you gonna transform? You look like you're gonna transform. God damn, these enemies are annoying. Oof. Are you not one of them? Oh, you are. Oh, thank God. Oof. Bro, those guys, though, I know they have that attack that does like 3,000 damage. And I thought it was going to hit us. And I was like, I don't know how to read it. Please, no. Oh, these blue things are chests on the mini map. I didn't realize. The Blessed Sleeve Gauntlets. Okay. I know people mentioned that when you have uh, Benkai, you have to ring a gong to have him, like, shoot the arrows at the boss. And I didn't realize that. I think we killed him in two tries, so I guess it didn't matter too much. But now anytime I see a bell, I'm like, fuck, do I got swing at it? I got to fucking... What do I got to do? How, how work? What is the green thing on my mini-map? Is there a Kodama in here? Is he outside between the buildings? Okay, he is. I don't know what piece of gear we have on, or... It could be it could be one of our spirits or our soul cores. But the, uh, the sensor... Because I think it's when you get Amrita, increased mini-map awareness, basically. You can, we've got the buff right now. Uh -huh. 
Are you really just gonna run away, bro? I'm, I do not want to do that. These little fucking crabs. See ya. It'd be interesting if they had different soul cores for the small baby ones and the, the big fuckers. Any ambush? Maybe not. He doesn't know how to path to us. Oh, sorry, bud. See you in 15 seconds. I'm coming to you. This guy's just... You're just fucking dead. I don't even have to hit him. I've got you for three minutes. A little Spider-Man action on that guy. What do we got going on? A little ceremony? Look at these flowers. This is the type of shit my girlfriend would love. She'd want something like this in the house, for sure. I am not much of a, a decorator. Hence, uh, at some point, I don't remember when, we put this little fucking wall up. Because everything back there is trash. Well, not like g garbage, but just stuff. And I, you, I don't think you can tell. Maybe way up here, you see there's a little white spot. And then there's a black spot just beside it. Okay? That wall was painted like a barcode. Wasn't my idea. But it... Someone's idea. To paint that room like a goddamn barcode. This way no one's fucking scanning my location and I have to go, you know, to keep you off the fucking trail. All right, back to business. This feels like boss territory, but I see two red dots, so maybe not. Oh, what's up buddy? Holy fuck. Bro, look at this guy's sword. Why does he sound so different? He sounds pre-puberty. In-game, but in the cutscene, this guy's fucking Giga Chad. Okay, well... Let's join him. What do we got going on here? The Buddha? And I don't know them. I mean, maybe I do, but I don't I don't recognize them at first glance. I couldn't even be wrong. Maybe that's not the Buddha. Looks very Buddha to me, though. He's sitting on the uh, the lotus. Or the, the petal. Are these his... Uh, what the fuck's the name? The Arhats? I feel like it starts with an A. His boys? Can't remember. It's been a while. It's been a while since I took a Buddhism class. But if you've never taken a Buddhism class, just believe what I say. Because fuck it. It's information. Right, wrong, left, right. Who's to say? Oh my god. Absolute domination. Hey. Well. Do the charm. What do we got going on here? Oh, a level up. Well, that I will take. Uh, we. I think we can even put on another feather. And We'll have to level them up to get more, but... Wait, they also cost less. You can get six for four at max level. Otherwise, you get three for six. Oh, no, it's one and a half each. Sorry. So, it's not... Never mind. Forget I said anything. I looked at it wrong. 
never mind, never mind. I thought the rate was like ridiculous when you level them up, but it's much it's much more fair. Who the hell is this? Oh. Okay. Sounds fine to me. Oh, well, fuck. Let's CSI this fucking guy. Dominated. What do we got down there? Can we shoot this guy's horns off? And when I say can we, I mean can I hit the shot? Oh. My man can lob those things. See ya. Okay, I feel like up is the way, so let's go down first. What's poking around? Ugh. Yeah, fuck you, bud. I do like that when these guys are electrified, you can just like stagger them with a heavy attack. Even if they're in the middle of doing some sus shit. Makes the fights much more manageable considering they don't want to fight. They just want to hide. This looks like it could be a door. Do you have eyes? Nope. What if I just hit it? Nope. I know you can see the like the eyes ahead of time. You don't have to walk up to them and have them open. But sometime. Oh. We'll just arrow this guy to death. See ya. Okay, we need to get this Kodama. Oh, we gotta go around. Tall grass. Do you crouch? Can you crouch? I don't even know. Let's make sure we don't die here. Hey. See you, bud. Oh my god. Oh. Beautiful. That confusion just feels right. Hit him with it. Whoa. Whoa, no thank you, sir. Sweet. Okay. Uh he up there? Oh he is. Okay, well let's not forget our, our fucking boy over here. Dude, when enemies are, like, weak to fire, holy fuck, it's awesome. And I like that we have access to all of the elements here. Because we've got lightning talismans, we have, um, Kasha, and we have the guardian spirit for the water. Obviously, if you can't hit the water, then, well, 
fuck them, but... Having access is nice. Because if enemies are weak to specific things, you can make it work. Oh. Not bad. Yeah. That's fine, though. Let's clean them up. Can't outrun me, motherfucker. Okay, so... Do these link? Does it matter which direction we go? Oh, fuck. Okay. Try something out here. Oops. Ah, this guy does not like a lightning. That is interesting. Oh, fuck. Oh, who are you, brother? Can you come down here? What is happening? Why am I in a fight of the ages here? Oh my god. Wait, how the fuck do I get back up there? Oh, this is the undergrowth. I heard another Kodama. I assume he's up there. Oh. Oh, fuck. Stay away from my friend. I want a cannon, this guy. Can we just avoid a fight with you in general, my friend? We can. Oh, there's the Kodama. Alright, let's go get him. A rescue is on the way, my friend. Assuming I don't fall off this fucking log. This sky log. Well, fuck. Get down here, bro. What are you doing? It's so indecisive. Coming back for some brother? <laughs> Ooh. You know what that means. I don't know what it means either, actually. I don't know why I said it like that. Yeah, well, we don't even use that attack because it's fucking trash. Uh, I don't like that attack either. Follows up a quick attack with a blow using the butt of the spear. I guess that's... <sighs> we already use a bunch of these, though. That attack seems cool. Charge. Those attacks are always tricky, though. I guess this is fine because we could then kind of parlay that decision into this if we wanted to okay wait a minute oh we don't have the goddamn key unlocked okay we need to do that if you look at our key we clearly don't have the 60 key that you get from leveling it like it up on the skill trees so we have to do that I, I've completely forgot it's been so long since we like really use the spear a ton that I didn't even notice. Oh. Okay, who's this? Oh. Oh. 
that's unfortunate for you there, brother. Oh. oh! Dude, holy fuck. That would have been bad. I don't know where our fucking bum ass friend went. Hopefully he'll teleport. Oh, here's at least we got the ladder. Fuck it. We got the ladder. No big deal. We're actually, we're going to go down and rest at the shrine because I feel like we used a ton of our stuff. And I like stuff. So I want it back. Oh, there you are. Oh, when he's teleported, he can figure things out. How delightful. Okay. It's the time of the founders. Oh, the founders of the plan. Oh, Jesus. Why is this shit bouncing? That was the fucking ambush that... I can't believe they blocked the fucking Kasha core. That's what kind of fucked us. Ooh. Been a while, my friend. We would have we would have destroyed him way faster if we had the other mystic art on. That's crazy to me. Oh hello. I feel like we fucking dominated him anyway. No no no. What do we have here? Uh yeah, we'll just give him this. Drop it. One of the swords we picked up at like the very end of the game. Like our, our very first time beating Otekamaru. Clawed fists. Oh, it's like default ones. The thing I like, I know you can change your appearance, but some of the fist weapons are oh, so good. They look so cool. Like easily the coolest design of the weapons. Maybe there's a couple of hammers that look fucking dope. But the fists, that's where the fucking, the money shot's at. Ooh, level up. Again? Okay, if you say so. I'll do it if you say so. Oh, this guy's just a person. Thought he'd be, uh, possessy spaghetti. It's not. So we must be nearing the actual, like, general then. Oh, he's probably right here. Wait, I hear... Oh, hello. Are you the last one? You know, we never did get into that pool, so I clearly missed something. Maybe not obvious, but... 
It's the way it goes. Alright. In we go. Let's figure out what we're up against. Oh, that guy. Oh, he's dying! Holy fuck, he got headshotted. Oh. That was kind of brutal. Wait, what? Oh. Oh, and we're fucking dead. Well, thank God we get to respawn. <laughs> Oh, I don't maybe you can't block that shit. Okay. I don't know what's happening. Okay, well. I thought that I could get out if I used that because I had no stamina, but it was too long. This is kind of fucked. Okay, he's not with us anymore, so let me think real quick. There's certain things that we should put on instead. Build anima. I feel like this guy's a bird, so I imagine lightning does some fucking work to him. He's just so fast. I feel like you have to be aggressive. Feeling like that's the uh, the move. We also we will have our spirit as well. This guy doesn't get debuffs on him. That's fine, we got that one. Ooh, corruption, interesting.
Oof, that is unfortunate. Oof. Oh my god. We played that fucking incredible. Every time we got the corruption on him, we were so hyper aggressive. Holy shit. Let's fucking go, man. Boom! Okay. Yes. Just shifling things. <laughs> what is this? I'm gonna play the flute. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Call it a fucking airstrike. Yo, Senka, ni makikonda. Shin no tekiwa. いまだ人の闇に潜む争いを生む飛行であれば我が志を打つ刀ある限り did he put his spirit in the sword? Is this supposed to consume them, no? Wait. Is that the end of the DLC? Oh, possessed by a hoe? Via Spirit Division? Okay. That boss is fucking crazy. Holy shit. It's that old shrine again. So I have returned to my own time, but that was no illusion, no dream. The sound of that flute still sounds in my ears. Where next? The fragment of memory Yoshitsune shared with me was guiding me. I know it, and so a new journey begins. Seto Tashi Soul Core? What does it do? Just stuns people? I mean, that's pretty sick. To be honest, it's pretty sick. 
Wait, so... Oh, Benki's in the... Or the Benkai's in the interim. Prisoners of the Stones. Wait, what did this one say? Acquire Saigo's poem in Yashima, Hirazumi, and Kurama. I think we have two of them. I'll have to... I'll have to look that up. Now... Shiftlings, baby. Shiftlings. I want this. Waken faster, baby. Um, What were we doing over here in the samurai tree? Got so many of these. I don't know if it matters that much. We're going to have them all at some point. Fuck it. What did I get? We got the flute. See more flute. Water damage. Usimi Dori. Huh. This is pretty good. Is this his sword? Oh no, Smirk Wiper? We've had this before. Huh. Nothing too crazy. We did get... Hold on. We did get the... Uh, our friends. Oh. Imbue Purity. Amrita Earned. Whew, that's pretty good. That's pretty fucking good. And you get 8% high attack damage as your, your inherent fucking thing. Okay, well, remember what I said about using uh, Shinroku? Well, we're not fucking doing that. I'll tell you that for free. Uh, unassigned, unassigned, unassigned. This is the new... This is our new hoe. I'll tell you that for free. Call her up. What do we have? 25 attunement. Huh. Anima charge on a strong attack. 5%. Wait a minute. Oh, that's all of them, I guess. Okay, so we already have that ability. High attack damage, though. 4% because it's the passive one. Yeah, are you fucking kidding me? Of course. This one seems fucking cracked. So, Kasha's always going on there, because, of course. Um, I want to put on Bent Guy. What the fuck was it called? Seito Taisho. Oh, it's just like a shield. Oh, this is sick. Yeah, put this on. And then we have quite a bit of points left, actually. Can we put on the new core? We can. Sweet! So we just get 4% high damage, which is basically what we use with our sword anyway. Fuck yeah. Let's, uh, let's speak with Benkai here. Let's see what he says. I mean, he didn't talk to us, so... Bring along our goat and cat friend. Have them, uh, ask the questions. I heard him. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Do I have to hit B or? Are we going to get a rematch? Against our boy. He did. I figured. Alright, 
All right. Okay. Yeah. We'll fight you, buddy. Our boy's still down there. Everyone else is gone. Well, he's still in here. A little Kappa. A little Kappa boy. Okay. I feel like that's a good place to end this episode. After dominating the fucking competition. And here's what I think the plan will be for next time. Because clearly there's a mission here and I'm missing some of the poems. I'm going to look in. I'm just going to look up how to get them because I want to play the mission and I'm not running through all the goddamn missions again. Right? Normally I wouldn't do this, but for the purpose of playing through all the missions, um, I want to. So I will either do this in the next episode. We will speed run to the poems and we can just chit chat about stuff. How uh, will we do that? We'll do that first, then we'll bang out our last three side missions to, I guess, finish the Tengu's Disciple. I think that might be the play. So we'll do one more mission with Tengu's Disciple before we move on to the darkness in the capital. Okay, cool. It was a, it's a neat, neat DLC. I know we're not done yet, so I guess I'll hold off on saying anything, but sick boss fight. Uh, kind of interesting it's kind of tough to be honest i mean we, we just we managed to hit our fucking burst counters and we stayed close in the pocket with the spear we were good on our dodges we weren't like too overly greedy the corruption made a huge difference obviously because we were allowed to just like continuously push because we never had to worry about key even in the dark realm or worry about it less um overall though fucking hash brown tight type fight so sweet I will catch you guys in the next one. If you enjoyed, please leave a like. Maybe subscribe if you're new. Carry on this journey with us in this little community we have. And I will catch you guys in the next one as we head into the poem mission. Take care. Goodbye.